hello. Okay, so the tone of this video is serious. And I'm gonna try to make it funny as fuck. <clears throat> okay, so I wrote down some notes. And the first one is looking down in society. Because, um, I don't look down at the ground. Like, I've only looked down, like, maybe three times in my life. Like, the first time I ever looked down in society was when I got glasses. And they were so heavy that it, like, tilted my head down. So I looked down. <laughs> And then the second time was when I was, like, left out of high school and sitting by myself at lunch. And I finally looked down in um, the lunchroom at my sandwich. And I thought in my head, sandwich. I told that story before. So, yeah. And then the third time was just, I don't know, just random. Just to do it. And then, like... <clears throat> I don't know, I just notice it everywhere, like, the Japanese do it, they think it's sad, like, when Cyan or Cayenne Pepper, like, look down, just like, okay, pixelated, and then Colleen Haskell even did it, and she's, like, the perfect cute girl, number one survivor, after they, like, lost the immunity challenge, and I was like, aw, that they showed that shot of her. The editors are so creepy, you know? Just showing that. And like, I notice little kids do it too when they're like ignored. And it makes me want to ignore them more because that's what you're supposed to do. Because <laughs> it's so funny seeing little kid disappointment. The word life. So life to me is just like RPG. <laughs> It's just like lives, like, um, the world, everything going on at the same time, the land, um, the village, villages, grass, field, grasslands, grass fields, it's just everything. All encompassed into one, two, three. <laughs> Period. Um, so that's what life means to me. Is just like I don't know. It's just RPG. <laughs> um, the second is the word rices, like um, the plural of rice just rices like um me and my Indian friend I forgot if he was Indian or um Pakistani but his name was Arshdeep and um we used to connect on an Asian level and we used to just make fun of rices and like do you fluff your rice and like just rices <laughs> <laughs> it's just funny. Um, and I'm like probably the only person that prefers this way, but popping your ears out, like I pre I do this all the time, like a lot like, push the air out my ears because I let my ears out. <laughs> and um, does anyone know that bookstore on the corner of Gary Boulevard and 15th? Because it disappeared, and um, they had the best books on everything. They had Wiccan books, they had Christian books, they had, um, it was just the best bookstore ever, and the business that took over was, uh, it was a lot of Boulevard Coffee, Book Coffee. That bookstore on the corner, period. Uh, so the next one is, how do you pronounce Marley? In fifth grade, at the lunch table, we used to have this like, group session about just RPG games. And we were on Chrono Trigger, what are you on? 
And I just, like, blurted it out. I was like, how do you pronounce Marley? And then my friend was just like, oh, Marley. We say Marley in my White House. So it's Marley. <laughs> That's pretty hard to say, though. And it's M-A-R-L-E. And you're like, Marley. <laughs> okay. K. I think there's three Ks. Oh, four. Okay, so life before 1999, period, dash, backwards. Um, yeah, that was like a good time. It was like before Survivor, the game started, and like they did it. Katakawa Shoten, like Japanese people clapping in a business circle. So yeah, games before 1999 were pretty good. <laughs> And the one I was thinking of was Mystic Quest, because I like, I think that was 1991, I used to read the box over and over, um, and my friend showed me, like, the Dragon Claw, and I thought that was pretty cool, <laughs> so I'm just like, Dragon Claw, and then Dash screen names. <laughs> Okay, are a big deal. Serious. So, I guess the thing that took over now, new generation, is just your screen name. And, like, African Americans is just like, oh, just use your name. Your name is your brand name, brand, and, like, I don't know. Um, it's a lot of screen names. So, my screen name that I came up with in my head by myself, I'm an only child on the computer by myself alone, was VidKid369, but that's my original AOL screen name, so that's pretty official up there high on the list uh, of screen names of mine. But it's not really official until your friend gives you a screen name. You know, like, do you have friends? You have friends, right? <laughs> do you have friends, right? So it was my friend, and he, I was on AOL, I mean, AIM, AIM, and he was just like, here. You know, like, this is your screen name. I thought it up for you, so use it. And it was, um, I get the hate for this, but it's Water Polo Wrestle. So, I might think about using that one. Oh, this is my favorite. Um, I just, like, pretend that stalkers out there is just like, oh, like, can you just, they're just like, we love America, like. We love the way you guys say stuff. And they're just like, can you please say the word Mercury? Okay. And I just wanted to end this one before I go eat breakfast. Is um, I kind of want to go back to that, but I like said it. <laughs> Funniest moment from high school, okay? I don't want to write down what I wrote because it's so funny. But I was at um, school and then, like, of course, it was the, um, just, I just called the loudspeaker. I don't know why, or the intercom. And then it was, like, we had a radio show and it was, like, two people, a boy and a girl student. And the girl was talking, and she was just um, delivering the news. And I was in math class. I believe it was uh, geometry. Or wait, no, it was like algebra two or something like that. Um, and she was talking about future colleges, and she was like telling all of us. She was like, "Oh, don't forget to put in your college applications. Take high school seriously." Woo, woo, woo. And then she like said Dartmouth, and in my head I said Dartmouth, and even my math teacher said Dartmouth, and it just makes me think of the bad toucher friend. Um, he had a really pointy tongue. And he, like, took a picture of himself on Facebook with it out, sticking out, darting out, pointy, like a little lizard. And I was like, why do you do that to yourself? 